back to my channel and today I'm going to speak on the topic of self-affirmations to live life with intention. Okay, so here's something like a, like a riddle. I define who I am every day. <clears throat> we tend to define ourselves by what others think of us. We constantly try to pull ourselves apart trying to fit into an opinion that has no meaning to our everyday life. If we're not confident about ourselves, then an opinion can have a severe blow to our self-esteem, which may take years to recover. Remember, we are not defined by what others think of us. We are special, we are unique, and we are important. Second, I am not defined by my failures. After a failure, the motivation we once had has left us. We isolate and shy away from the things we once wished and dreamt about. We tell ourselves that I can't do this and eventually we stop trying. We stop trying because we believe that we are failures. The failure is not the end but the beginning of new adventures. The movie 12 Fail is the best example for this. The failure does not define your future. Third, taking care of myself is my own responsibility. Self-care is something that many people don't take serious. It is the most important thing in your life. One thing that I have learned that self-care is not selfish. It is picking a day or two to make yourself priority. The job that you've always been stressing over will be there all the time, so will you? Try things like mindfulness, spend time with your family or friends, or just take a nice short walk around the neighborhood. Fourth, I will no longer entertain toxic people or toxic relationships. Sometimes in life, we find ourselves holding on to relationships that weigh us down and prevent us from elevating. We just hold on for the comfort, but deep down inside, we know it's not healthy. We make excuses and try to find reasons why this relationship is still needed in our lives. When you're no longer thriving and find yourself in a continuous cycle, then it's time to release those toxins out of your life. We all deserve a life free from toxic people. Fifth, I will intentionally be kind to myself every day. Did you know that we are the harshest critics of ourselves? Yes, we criticize ourselves about 85% of the day. Can you imagine the long-term effect of such a bad habit on our brain? It is hard to be kind to ourselves because of such high standards. We force ourselves to become a version of us that is not genuine. However, it doesn't have to be like this. When you practice saying nice things to yourselves, then eventually you will notice the positive outcomes it has on your well-being and your self-esteem. Slowly, you will come to appreciate the beautiful person you are. Life is really beautiful and we have to live with intention. So, life is beautiful, so we need to live it with intention. Thank you for watching. Bye.